I was born in a little um, lovely village called Eket in Nigeria um, to uh, a father who was uh, very involved in politics um, in the 60s and my mother was a nurse uh, at the time. Taking after my mother, um, I decided to go into nursing. The reason why I went into nursing was again to take forward this attitude of saving, service to people, service to humanity. But um, above all, it was a profession very dear to my mother. My mother was a practicing nurse but didn't have a degree in nursing and wanted uh, one of her children to take forward her profession. I really enjoyed nursing because it exposed me to not just service to humanity, but it allowed me to challenge myself um, working with some of the sensitivities of being a younger person going into nursing as a profession. I went to the University of Hull to do my PhD. At the end of doing my PhD, I was just looking around for a city in the UK that had the uh, cultural mix that would help me to take forward my passion. So I came across a job in, um, at the School of Nursing in Bradford, uh, looking for somebody to teach biological sciences to nurses. That's how I came to Bradford in 1995. Every human being deserves to be significant, um, has to be appreciated, has to be valued and be included. And therefore, I have this personal commitment and a passion to ensure that everywhere uh, human beings um, are involved, that I would strive to ensure that they achieve these four things, significance, appreciation, value, and be included. I think the big thing that I've achieved in the role um, of being first, firstly the race champion for the university, but generally as being a professor of diversity, has been the awareness raising, the profile raising around equality and diversity, that it's okay to talk openly about equality and diversity, not just at the point of how representative the university has been, but at the point of also looking at how participative different people, different constituencies have been in promoting the work of the university. If I was approached by somebody from a minority uh, community, minority background, or even anybody from the general uh, population that wanted to know about what Bradford stands for in terms of its work around equality and diversity, I would be saying you have picked the best place to come to.